We are in the theater at the McCrory Marketplace Great Hall, and I am talking to Sarah Nail, who is going to be playing Catherine Hyatt in our next show, The Last Five Years, by Jason, uh, Jason Robert Brown. Jason Robert Brown, mm -hmm. that's right, that's right. So, uh, I have a few questions for you, uh, and if you would be so kind to okay. help us out here. Um, we know this play is not done very often, and so can you tell us a little bit about it? Oh, I definitely can. It's funny that it's not done more often because it's such a small cast. It's just two people, a man and a woman, and it's the story, it's a love story from beginning to end through the last five years. Now what's interesting about it is that they both tell their stories, but one is starting at the end of their love and one is starting at the beginning. And unfortunately, I am the one who gets to start off the show in a very dark, sad place. And he starts off nice and happy. And the only time that they are at the exact same time together is when they get married. So then she ends the show. You get to see her excitement and her joy at meeting him and falling in love. But you get to see what has happened. You get to see his sad ending. All right, that's different for mm -hmm. sure. Different structure altogether. So what do you think audiences will like about this? Well, the music is amazing. Jason Robert Brown is an amazing composer, and if you don't know any of his other shows, you should listen to them. But <laughs> um, aside from the music, what's great about this is that the characters are real, and they're organic, and the problems that they are encountering are problems that we, as audience members, encounter in our own private lives. So mm -hmm. it's relatable. Very good. Now, you're playing Kathy. Mm -hmm. um, what can you tell us about her? Kathy is, she wants to be an actor in New York, so she's actively auditioning. She's driven, and she knows how she wants things to be, and um, she's slightly, slightly neurotic is my <laughs> understanding of her, but um, she goes through a lot, and she's got a lot of heart. Huh. So how are you approaching uh, the role? How are you getting into it? Uh, well, I relate with her a little bit already, but the biggest challenge that I'm having, which I already mentioned, is trying to find a way to start off in that desolate emotional space. Mm. Normally, you get to start off happy and ex go through the experiences that lead your character to the pain and sadness, but in, in this case, you have to start with the result of all of the pain and sadness, and so mm. that's what I'm currently dealing with. This is actually the night of my first rehearsal, so I'm excited. Oh, <laughs> good. Well, what excites you about the show? What, everything? Oh, I'm, I, I love this show. I can't believe that I get to be in it. I've been listening to it for years. I'm excited to work with our director, Tyler, and Jamie, my love interest, is a friend of mine that I've performed with a lot, and the music director is actually my husband. So <laughs> it's just going to be a great time for me. <laughs> I hope it's a great time for all of us, and I know it will be with you in this show. <laughs> so thanks so much for telling us about it. No problem. And do you have any other uh, words that you'd like to tell people about um, the show? Come see last five years. It'll be wonderful. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you so much, okay. sir.